Hi, this is Jeff. Crucial conversations and also crucial accountability training, apart from the principles and skills, both contain a wealth of practice scenarios to help you to gain real confidence in using the skills. My favourite exercise in my favourite training, crucial accountability, is in real life probably one of the most toughest conversations that you'll have, and that is dealing with and managing an overly demanding micromanagement boss. If you suffer from one of these, particularly if you're working in a very hierarchical organisation, then trying to resolve this will definitely keep you awake at night. There are three steps, simple but maybe not so simple to apply, to work safely and respectfully with even the most demanding micromanagement boss. Number one, describing the gap. One of the key principles in the training is how you share with your manager your expectations of being managed versus what you're observing or experiencing with your boss. Number two, make it safe. This is the foundation from crucial conversations and accountability training, is your ability to be able to create and maintain safety. Without creating safety, describing the gap is nearly impossible and pretty overwhelming. And number three, make it motivating. Share natural consequences. Sharing with your boss the adverse effect upon your performance of his management style and possibly also the impact it has upon your peers. Whilst using this process is not designed to be a magic bullet to somehow reprogram your boss's brain, what it will do is help create safety for you to share your concerns in an open, respectful and collaborative way. We'll see you on the next video.